Good afternoon. I wanted to do a quick video on this uh, product I found. Um, you go buy a two hundred fifty dollar hitch, and uh, you don't want the thing walking away for sure. And uh, besides taking it off all the time and putting it up in the you know putting it in your toolbox or whatever, I mean, I'd rather keep it on the truck. I mean, that's why it's designed like this, where the this is a B and W tow and stow, uh, where you can flip it over where the ball's not sticking out. Um, of course, it's made to stay on your truck. You know, that's the main feature of it. Um, everybody's seen the locking pins. Um, let me see. I think I have one right here. Give me just a second. Let's see. Yeah, here's one right here. So I have one of these regular locking pins that uh, most people, you know, have seen. Um, I don't know if everybody's seen the video online, but, uh, basically... You put this on your truck, uh, you get a piece of pipe, you slide it over this side, and you just yank it, and it will snap off on here. Uh, the reason it snaps off is because if you look at this, uh, this is the same way, basically. This is where it locks, so the, the, the thing locks around this little groove. So that little groove makes the, makes the pin thinner, right? Uh, being it makes it thinner, that's the weakest part. So when you put some leverage on here with a piece of pipe, it snaps off and bam, your trailer hitch is gone, right? Um, people can do it within, you know, 10 seconds sometimes they say. So when I bought my hitch, I was looking for something that would uh, kind of stop that. There's not a lot out there, to be honest with you. I couldn't really find anything that was uh, 100%. It didn't appear. I mean, they do have some that aren't straight, on one end, um, it's um, curved where well, you can't put a piece of pipe on it, which is helpful, but the other side is not um, curved. So, <laughs> you know, it, it, it doesn't, doesn't do it all the way. Um, so I found this one. Uh, this is made by Let's Go Arrow. Um, it is a silent hitch pin is what it's for. It's for cutting down on, this, on the sound of the, uh, the uh, hitch rattling in, in the receiver. Um, the way it works, I'll just kind of do it right here first. Uh, you put your pin in, right? Uh, then you put your locking pin, and it slides in on this side. Uh, like I said, it, it, it kind of does the same thing, uh, same kind of locking. Sorry, it's hard to do with one hand. So it locks the same way. Uh, but the, the thing about this one is the, the big difference is this little piece right here, and it's installed already. So right down in there, if you can see that. Um, that big square piece is threaded. Okay. This side right here is threaded. And then this is a, 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 a bolt style. So when you put it in, it threads. So it's threading itself inside that pin, inside that, uh, big square piece in there. Right. So this is where the silent part comes in. When you tighten it down all the way, right, it, it locks its, it pulls itself tight against the, the, the receiver down there. Um, and really quiet, you know, it makes it where it doesn't, sh r that doesn't rattle. But what, to me, when I saw this, what I saw was that you're bolting this on, you're bolting this in place, right? So you get a 16 millimeter wrench, you can bolt, and bolt this thing down right and you make it where it's tight where it doesn't rattle but it does two things to me you can't get this off without having a wrench with you all right so when people are going out and trying to steal your hitches you know they're you know trying to get it in you know within seconds and be gone kind of thing um get the pipe pop it and then, then run off they're most likely not going to be carrying a wrench with them and take the time to unbolt this uh, so anyway I saw that I was like, man, that's 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 exactly what I need. So I'll put it on real quick, and uh, we'll continue. Just give me a second to put the camera down and get it installed. One second. Okay, so now I have it installed on the truck. All right, so you can see that spring in there earlier, right? So there it is, holding on. So it's, it's loose. I've got it locked on, so that part's locked, right? So here we go, I'm gonna tighten this down. See it, see it snugging up over there. All right. So now look, that took all the all the play out of it, right? 
and the pin is tight. I mean, it's you can't move it either, right? So put the pipe on here. If somebody breaks it off, that's fine. This is still bolted on. They can't unbolt that unless they have a wrench. I mean, it's on there tight too. And they can't put a piece of pipe on that and break that part off. So there you go. It's uh, to me that should be enough to deter somebody. And the, most likely the thief doesn't even know that that they need a wrench. So they might try to break this off, but they're not going to get the hitch off. So anyway, thought I'd share. Uh, everybody have a great day. Thank you.